So, today is an interesting day as the Awakening DLC came out for PlayStation 3 users. So, what you're seeing is the Eisendrak Zombies gameplay on last gen. This is on PS3. And I think the gameplay just says it all, really. There's not really much else I need to say apart from damn, this game does not look that great on the previous gen. I tweeted out asking if you guys would be interested in seeing some gameplay, and there's been a ton of you that have said yes and wanted to see it, so here we go. This gameplay is provided to me by my good friend iCrazyTeddy. I don't have a PlayStation 3, so I couldn't do this and suffer through this, so I let him do it instead. But here you can see the Panzer, and the Panzer sold at... It has no face. The texture is just one clear texture. And as you can see, he's got the storm bow. And there's no crazy tornado that happens after you charge a shot. It's just some measly lightning bolts. And ah, there's just like one singular color in this room. And there's no proper lighting. Like you'll see later on in the video outside near the... Uh, the trap there is just no light in this map it's crazy i will say this though the gameplay is pretty darn smooth it's pretty accurate to the next gen version and being honest if the graphics do look horrible but once you get over the fact that they look so bad it's playable at least shadows of evil looks really bad on last gen this still looks quite bad but it i'm pretty sure shadows of evil was worse and to be honest besides the lighting in this i don't think it looks that bad it does look bad but it definitely is playable and everything from the next gen version is in this we've got the entire easter egg the cutscene looks ridiculous ridiculous by the way we've got all four bows we've got all the little easter eggs that you've come to know and expect so the the really is that the exact same version you're getting on last gen apart from just the really nice graphics one thing i will say though it's so weird how we are in the low gravity and like the color doesn't change in the room it doesn't go blue like it normally does it's still the same color with just this weird kind of static weird blue dots flying around it's really really crazy but i'll show you some gameplay where we go outside now so we're not stuck down in the bastion pyramid room but you can just you can just see it it just doesn't look very nice but once we get outside as well especially the texture outside the map when you look over to like the kind of city below the actual castle itself and when you've got to shoot out the map for the storm bow there is really nothing there it's so bad to look at there is just so little texture Things look out of place, that's what I'm going to say for that. There's like weird floating spheres, you just see the weird kind of thing you've got to shoot with the electric bow just sticking out like a sore thumb and then just like a floating ro rocket pad, it is not cool. So here is the gameplay of us showing you in the main section of the map and there's the mountains outside the map look so bleak there is nothing to them at all and i'm not sure if this is some sort of weird texture glitch or if this is actually in the last gen but here we get a golden ray gun out of the mystery box this is just the default camo that is on the ray gun in last gen it wasn't like this in shadows of evil so i don't know if this is just some nice little easter egg that the guys over at beanox and the other development guys that actually work on last gen version put in the game because it's definitely not in the next gen version and when you have obviously seen the ray gun upgraded it doesn't have that gold camo anymore but you can definitely see this is a gold camo this isn't glitched out or anything this is a last gen gold camo ray gun and we've never seen a ray gun with a gold camo on it before this is really really crazy stuff let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section right now what do you think of last gen der eisendrak does it look good does it look pretty powerful let me know your thoughts and if you found the video enjoyable drop it a like rating let me know your thoughts on the golden ray gun as well because that's quite interesting but thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed some last gen dot eisendrak i hope your eyes aren't too damaged from seeing that but i'll catch you on another one very very soon